Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a linen closet makeover, declutter, and organization video. I hope you guys like these kind of videos for me. If you do, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing. I would love to have you as part of my YouTube family. All right, guys, so go ahead and prepare yourself because when I open up this closet door, you are going to be completely shocked and I'm gonna be embarrassed because it is a complete disaster. When we moved in about six months ago, Everything just kind of got shoved in every which way or other. It's a complete disaster. There is absolutely zero organization. There are tons of things in here that don't belong in here. Um, towels with holes in them, sheets that are worn out, comforters that we no longer use, um, tons and tons of stuff that just needed to be decluttered and organized. Um, lots of these things I ended up either donating or the things that were in really bad shape, I tossed. I also um, used some of the old towels for cleaning rags and whatnot. So this is the before complete disaster. And then we're going to look at it after it's all cleaned out. All right, so here is a view of the closet all decluttered and completely cleaned out. As you can see, I do have quite a bit of space to work with. It is a fairly large linen closet, and so I'm really pleased with the space that I have. I like the depth of the shelves, and so I just measured everything, and then I went shopping, and I'll link everything that I bought below for you guys in the description box. All right, so here I just started by putting all the different containers in and just seeing how things look and what fit and how I was gonna organize things. I ended up going back to Ikea and getting some more of the white storage containers, the larger ones, because um, I wanted to be able to store regular bath towels, beach towels, sheets, blankets, all of those things that each of the bedrooms needed in this one spot. So I did end up, the final product looks different than it does here. All right guys, so this is how I fold my bath towels. I have a very specific way. I like to fold them in half and then in half again and then fold them over to the inside of each other. And this just helps with keeping them organized and then everything fits nicely. And it's just, it's the way I've always done it. And these are just the labels that I used for the linen closet organization and so that everyone in the house would know where things are. These labels are from an Amazon shop. It's called Talented Kitchen, and I will link them in the description box below. I also used her labels in my pantry makeover video, and I will also link that in the description box below. She has tons of different labels, um, just anything you can think of, she has labels for them. Really awesome, she's great to deal with, and I love these labels, they go on the containers very easily, they fit nicely, and I really like the font. It comes across very farmhouse, and like I said before, I did use them in my pantry makeover, and they've held up and done very well, and I've been super pleased with them. I also have this other brand of labels. Um, these I purchased from Hobby Lobby, and um, well, I do like these and they were okay and I do like some of the um, different options that they have like for the sheets so that the girls know because my husband and I have a king bed, the other girls have full or queen so they were able to tell which was which. Um, I just didn't feel like once I stuck these on the containers, they didn't stick as nicely as the ones that I received from Talented Kitchen. So I did use these and they were okay, but um, I did prefer the Talented Kitchen ones, but there was just certain things that weren't in that pack that um, I needed 
to organize because it just helps with the teenagers and the little one I can just say you know go grab the pool towels they're on the bottom they know where everything is um, and I did use um, on the back here they have ones where you can customize your own and I did use those for the top for the bath rug so these did come in handy as well okay so here is an overview of what the linen closet looks like once I was completely done I'm extremely happy with it I love how everything looks clean and neat and organized everything has a space everything's labeled and this just makes my heart sing. I love when things are organized and look nice. All right, so here is the top shelf. I have this basket from Target that has bath rugs in it. And then in the middle, we store the blankets. And then over on the other side, another basket of bath rugs. Down on the second shelf, I have shower and bath products and then makeup wipes. And this way the teenagers can just, when they run out, they can just come right in here, pick out what they need, and it's right at their fingertips. And then next to that, I have a first aid kit. This has band-aids, hydrogen peroxide, alcohol wipes, whatnot. And then here is our toothbrush, toothpaste, anything dental related is here in this little container. And then down on the next shelf, I have this nice little wooden storage box that I got at Ikea and I have the cotton balls and I also got those containers at Ikea and then I have my little scented plug-ins and wax melts and then this little decorative um, greenery from Ikea and then in the middle this little container came from Ikea and I'm storing the washcloths and then the guest towels behind it and then over on the other side I have cotton swabs in this glass jar bath bombs behind that, more plug-ins, and then of course another greenery decorative to balance it out. Then on the next shelf below that, this is all the bath towels. All my towels are white. I do prefer white towels and washcloths because then I'm able to bleach them and also use OxyClean to keep them white and nice and it's just easy for cleanup. Um, as well as on the next shelf I have sheets and those are all white as well same concept as with the towels and then over on the right i have all the pillowcases into one container and then down on the bottom shelf i do have pool towels on the right toilet paper and kleenexes tissues in the middle and then pool towels over on the left as well we do go through quite a few pool towels in the summer because my girls love to go to the swimming pool all right, so here's one last look at the linen closet. I'm super happy with it. I love how pretty it looks and the functionality, and I just am so excited about the way it turned out. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing. I'd love to have you guys stick around for my future videos. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.